fundamentally, actually, if you talk in terms of uh, authority, uh, legitimacy, and credibility, um, the next Dalai Lama will be determined and decided by the present Dalai Lama, for sure, uh, because historically as well as uh, and traditionally, and then uh, Chinese government, some say, you know, they are uh, calculating to appoint their own uh, candidate. But in terms of legitimacy, credibility, and authority, there, they know, there is no comparison. On the one hand, you have Communist Party of China, which calls Dalai Lama a devil, which has banned the photograph of His Holiness Dalai Lama. If you're caught with one in Tibet, you could be arrested, even tortured. Even as a tourist, you might be expelled. And then you have His Holiness Dalai Lama, global statesman, advocate of peace and compassion. His Holiness just addressed uh, and uh, gave a public talk in Washington, D.C. 20,000 people came, 10 days of Kala Chakra teaching, a person of impeccable reputation. Who do you think of these two? should have a say in selecting the next Dalai Lama. The Communist Party of China or the Dalai Lama is hands down.